Hey everybody, it's Miss Leah from the Laurel County Public Library and I really hope you come to the library this week to see me because if you do, you are going to get to make a scarecrow. I'm going to show you how we're going to make this scarecrow now. Everybody's going to get a paper bag and then you're going to get all your pieces. You need a hat, you need some hair, some eyes, bow tie because every scarecrow needs a bow tie. Let's glue his hair on first. I went ahead and stapled his hair together, make it a little bit easier. That way we didn't have all kinds of hair to glue on. We're going to put that on first. Come over here and put some more hair on. I wish I knew the song from Wizard of Oz that the Scarecrow sang because I would sing it to you right now if I could remember the words. I should learn that next time I do Scarecrow Craft. Okay, let's get his hat on. Now, I'm going to glue his eyes on. Kind of googly eyes today. Let's make him look this way. There we go. He needs a nose. Let's turn it this way. If I turn it the other way, it looks like a beak. It'd be like a bird scarecrow. Let's go ahead and draw his mouth on. We're going to make just like a little U shape and then put some little dashes on it. And then at the top, we're going to glue on some little red cheeks. Two little drops of glue. It's a very happy scarecrow. And last but not least, a little bow tie. <clears throat> there we go. I think I did pretty good. It's pretty cute. Now let me show you what we're going to be reading this week. We're going to read The Lazy Scarecrow and a book simply called Scarecrow. So if you join me this week at the, program, or at the library for a program, you can hear some great stories. You can make a scarecrow. You can check out some of our great Thanksgiving books that we have up on display. And next week, keep in mind, if you watch my video, I'm going to have a new special guest joining me. So, I hope to see you at the library this week, guys. See you later.